Alright, welcome back to Fusion Tip Friday. The next tip I have for you is to download the Resolve Essentials script from the Reactor plugin. So what does Resolve Essentials do? The script allows you to map certain nodes to buttons on your keyboard. So once you hit the flow and you're moving around, if you want to add a certain node, you can hit the button on your keyboard and it creates the node just like that. So for example, if I want to merge node, I set it up. So if I hit A on my keyboard, my merge node is right here. What I also did is if I want to transform node, I can hit T on my keyboard and then I have a transform node right there. So in order to download Reactor, I have this video over here where it teaches you how to download it. And then once you have it downloaded, you go up to workspace, go down to scripts, then go down to reactor and then open reactor. Once the panel has popped up, what we have to do is search resolve essentials in the search bar. Then it's going to pop up towards the top and then we can click check mark box to install it and then close our reactor and maybe restart our DaVinci if it didn't install. And from there, it should already install the Fusion Hotkey Manager. For example, X on your keyboard it has some pre-inputted hotkeys that you can use on your flow graph right here. The way that we actually customize our own Fusion hotkeys is by going up to workspace, down to scripts, and it should be over here. So let's go to resolve essentials. Then you can go over to Fusion Hotkey Manager and that'll pop up this little hotkey manager window where you go to your views and you wanna go to the flow because this is what it's called over here where all the nodes are, the flow. And it allows you to map certain nodes to certain letters on your keyboard. You can see you have a bunch here. I believe there's another script that maps a bunch already for you, but the ones that I use are the ones that I mainly put in for the most part. And so you can see all of the key binds that are here. So if you just want to add a new hotkey, all you do is hit new and then you can type in whatever letter you want. So let's say, let's do Y for some reason. I don't know why oh, I don't hit control C. Sometimes it just messes up. So you just have to hit Y a couple times and there we go. And then we can go to actions or tools and see which one we want to do. So over here is like tools. So let's say color, let's do like color curves, something like that. Hit OK. And then now that is linked to the letter Y. It's all the way down here, color curves. And then you can hit OK. And then now every time I hit Y on my keyboard, the color curves node will pop up just like that. If you're interested in other tips like these, go check out my second channel where I'm probably going to upload more Fusion Tip Fridays over there, as well as on my Twitter, where I'm going to have this as a series popping up on my Twitter if you'd like to go follow me there as well. But other than that, please subscribe and have a good day.